guys effects here today we're back with another video now today i just have a little quick tip for you guys especially you guys money spenders if you don't spend money this helps you a lot but it's especially good for you guys who spend money now um quick tip for everybody that helps everybody is when you level up right you every time you level up you want to check every couple levels that there's going to be these special offers in the store like this offer right here this just had 80 overalls in it this offer right here was a dollar and then the dollar they had an 82 overall and you had a bunch of cards and this is what it is right here i'm going to show you now they're going to have these store offers all the time uh i'm selling golds right there i'm selling golds right now they're like 75 overall that are terrible they're going for like two thousand coins you want to be selling those gold cards as well so right here i'm going to pick up this adrian amos he's selling for about 33k this quick sells for 26k this is 33k this is a 7k profit right there i'm going to sell this for 30k auction and that's a 30k profit just for a dollar i basically spent a dollar and i got 30k imagine that if you spend imagine just multiply that it means ten dollars is 300k that's insane that means a hundred dollars is three mil like this is the best value for your money best bang for your buck now for all you money spenders now after you buy a bundle right a lot of people are lazy and after they buy their bundle they just mass quick sell their 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 uh their their golds for training like you'll have an item binder you have an item binder full of cards and you'll just start you'll just start swiping you'll just start swiping over it like this right and you'll just start selling it for training right now high overall golds it's whether you training is not that worth it because like for like certain cards like these right ap right he's going for three 3500 right this is the cheapest one so you can sell this for 3500 that means three of these golds are selling for 10k like so let's see these three so high overall golds you don't want it you don't want it like look at that 4.5k high overall golds you want to make sure for your high overall golds like you're selling these on the market this is pretty cheap 2k but high overall gold you want to make sure you're selling on the market now the low overall golds like 70 to 74 you can dump all of those for like let's say if you want to dump a dump them all for 1k it doesn't really matter they're low overall golds they're they're pretty useless so let's say i would do something like this quality um you no know, type where's the overall i'm trying to see though try to get the overall uh type is a type nah it just it would just be core gold so i would i would have to sort by yeah i would basically sort it like this and i would ascend it i'll press x to ascend and sell all these golds for 1k so now i have about 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 55 60 65 70 75 80 85 90 95 100 100 500 10 115 120 125 130 135 140 140 so now i basically would sell every one of these cards for about 1000 each some of them I'll sell for like 3,000. Like that's going for 3,000. I could easily get that off for 2,500. That's a wide receiver, 75 overall. This one I can get off for 2,000. Like, but you're just gonna sell them for 1,000 to sell them fast because I know everybody doesn't have a lot of EA access time. But remember, right now is the best time to do it because people are like, people are trying to budget their team, right? So they're trying to buy low level uh, golds and stuff like that and budget their team, just get a team full of golds. So people are doing solos, they finish their solos and then they're gonna buy their gold cards. But what they don't realize is that it, it, they should really just be saving their money and using like silvers that you get for free. But people are just gonna spend their money on golds. What you're gonna do is you're gonna sell all of these. You could tell, you could tell I got 140 of these, I could sell them for one, if I, if I sell them for 1,000 each, right? That means, look, that's 3,000. If I sell them for 1,000 each, I make 140K and I can use that to buy a high-end card. You know what I'm saying? But if I if I go through these one by one, I have about two hours left. I can sell them for like 2,000, 2,500, 3,000, 1,800, 1,200, like all types of money and just make a lot of coins. That's what I'm going to do now. Make sure you guys are doing that. That is a quick tip for you guys that are new to money. Make sure you guys are selling your gold cards. Do not put these into sets. Do not just quick selling for training make sure you're selling your gold cards that's just a quick tip for you guys hopefully you guys get that and you hopefully you guys make a little extra coins now make sure you keep in your high-end cards like 88 overalls 87 overalls 86 overalls 85 overalls do not sell those anything 84 and under you can sell unless it's a really good card like jamal adams adrian amos denzel ward stuff like that that has high speed but anything under that you can sell and all sell all your gold sell all your silvers for 500 600 700 each just do that. Trust me on this.
but yeah that's a quick money tip thank you guys for watching the video hope you guys learned something and i'm out peace